What's going on, you guys? I got another tool for you guys. It's going to be the Survival Hacks tool. It's a, supposed to be a 10 in 1 multifunctional tool. You have your the keychain and your clip. You have your paracord, a whistle, and you have a pill container. And once I let this off the pill container and keychain off of this, it then yanks this to unleash the rest of the paracord. And so then you have that. And inside the pill bottle, this thing is crazy. I didn't realize it had as much stuff or it could fit as much stuff in it as it does. You have your tender, you have your cloth to help the fire catch flame, like I said you have a bunch of stuff in here just crazy surprises, the stuff that you need though, that's the crazy thing, you got a, a two sided knife, one side is serrated, The other side is just made mainly, I guess, for chopping. You got your wire saw. Let's see, and then the rest of here, you have your bobbers and safety pins. You also have your fishing line and fiction hooks. So in the worst case scenario, if you got trapped somewhere in the woods, all you would have to have is this clip somewhere either on your bag or on your persons. Preferably on your persons, that way in case anything did happen, it would just still be right there on your side the whole time. And so if you had to fish, you could take a, I don't know, I guess you would take the edge piece of this blade, you chop into the, a good stick. You'd make enough to where you could tie a few knots around and put a fishing line on it, and that would work. But all in all, if you wanted to take a few things out of here that you may think that you may not need, just because you have it on a different thing, like let's say you may have a watch that has that tender in it, or you may have a watch that may already have the paracord in it, or a fishing line inside the in, on the inside of it. I've seen a few of them that open up in the middle, but I obviously don't have one. Um, one thing I would do if I were you guys, if I was going to take this out camping, I would get rid of this metal piece that you used for the keychain, and I would replace it with one that was maybe a lot thicker. Maybe one from your car uh, keychain, because those usually come a little bit thicker, and they're a little bit, they're less likely to bend. Such as this one. This one bends if I pull on it while that paracord is attached to it. And so every time I pull it up to pull this through, it will pull from down here. But, um, yeah, you guys, that is my video. Um, the way I'm getting all these products is through this website called Thomason. If you guys wanted me to do a video on it, and a video of how to actually set your profile up on it. I can. The website's free. But that's how I've been getting all my products for free. It's not none of this other stuff that some of these other people have been putting on Facebook and YouTube. Saying that they're receiving free products from doing all X, Y, and Z. Look, I'm a college student. And I look for the easiest way to do anything. So, my easiest way was to do product reviews. And after going to about three dozen sites, I didn't really go to three dozen, maybe like 5,000. Sounds a lot better. And I finally came up on this one. Crazy enough, they had all the things that you could use and all the things you could need on it. All you had to do was sign in, saying that you either a seller or you are a promoter and once you show that you are a promoter they just connect you with all these different programs and 
people that are trying to sell their product and trying to get promotional videos. And basically, that's how I got it done. Now, again, with this pill bottle, if you do decide to take anything else out and then actually put your actual pills in here, that would work as well. But I do recommend that if you were to do that, I would put it somewhere where the either the pill wouldn't get punctured or it wouldn't break. And given if you fall with this on, it's not gonna break at all. You'll it'll probably hurt you more than you'll hurt it. But if I was someone going camping, I would at least wrap it up in a plastic, a smaller plastic bag, and then in a cloth. And then I would put it in here with the wire saw. So I can, I can go ahead and take it out just so you guys can see it. And so. But you got your full wire saw here. And that is the video on. I should also show the cloth. Um, as soon as you just break it off, little pieces that you need, you can just set it wherever you need to in the pile of sticks. But that's my video. Just like and subscribe if you like it, guys. You want me to keep doing these? Thank you.